All right, guys, what you see in front of yourselves is a Dell XPS 15. It's a 9550 model. Uh, right now, I ran into an issue where, since I got an iPad and a phone and a gaming rig, which is over there, which I, I took apart just to um, see if the NVMe drive was the one, of, the thing at fault. Because right now, this laptop, believe it or not, it's not powering on. Uh, I tried everything. I tried a multimeter. I test the uh, cable from the wall. It's good. It's okay. The charger itself is okay. Uh, and believe it or not, also the charging jack is working at least from this point right here. Hold on, let me just open this thing. From this port to here, it's giving me correct ratings, which is 19 point something volts, so it should be fine. I did test the thing right here. I put my leads on the black and the, then the red leads over here. And it's giving me 9.5 volts, so I don't know if that's maybe an issue. But as you can see, there's no, no corrosion or nothing. At this point, I, I have no idea what to do, and I really don't want to deal with Dell. And like, yeah, uh, it's gonna take like three weeks for you to get your shit back. <laughs> Anyway, I didn't notice the NVMe drive right here. Hold on, where the hell is my flashlight? Okay, it's not here. Well, uh, you can see it's... Oh, hold on, what? You can see there's some weird stuff right there. Hold on, let me see if I can turn on the flash. Oh, huh, okay, I adjusted. You can see right there, it has some kind of gooey stuff on it. I don't know if the NVMe drive just melted or it's like that, because I do have a 860 Evo and it's not like this, so... Maybe this whole thing fried and I'm fucked because out of the year and a half that I had it, I only used it a couple of times. And it's kind of disappointing. I paid 2.1K two for this laptop and it's already breaking. I barely used this thing. It's disappointing. Uh, I'll let you know if I made any progress.